Now, Young Pharaoh came out live and told y'all that somebody drugged him. Now, he was talking about Lil Durk and everybody was laughing at him. Everybody was throwing it back in his face, right? But I feel like something really tapped with his brother. And now with this case going on with Rashad, I know definitely they did something to him. And y'all got to remember, Pharaoh was pretty big, bro. Like, he had a big... He was going across a lot of platforms, bro. Way bigger than Rashad. Way bigger. And I wasn't even paying attention at the time. But me going back, doing my homework, seeing how much they, de they deleted so much of his... Sh it don't even make sense. Now, this man came on live and told you he was drugged. One time I seen him live, bro, and he kept repeating himself for like 10 minutes. And the people in the comments was just laughing and talking like and agreeing. And I'm like, bro, he's glitching. Y'all don't see him glitching? Then you remember when they went live, right? Rashad caught it. He like, you got to fight it. You got to fight it. And he couldn't fight it. But even Rashad himself, he couldn't even really get like he told y'all like he yeah, mk ultra but y'all ain't really understand it i went through the phones i seen everything like, that I so got, many videos on the seats bro that i needed to see and y'all can keep trying to gaslight me and play with me and lie that's like what I they said. do and i'm realizing you know, that's that shit that's just happened to any one of us goddamn, uh, what you gonna call it? that shit ain't gonna that shit ain't gonna save you Look at him, that bro. Shit ain't gonna save you. Did you see that? That shit ain't gonna save you. He talking about him. That's not a regular right. face. It looks like he can't right even know, so that means they did relax his face. I don't know if somebody ever raped me. Like I said, if they did, I was drugged. But yeah, nah, all that gas, like you shit and that shit. Bitch, Look, they in know. the comments laughing because he always yeah, say they everybody they shot, they right? They, they laughing. They did. they did try to kill me and do that. Like I said, no. Bro, there's no way you go from that last we this know clip to that last clip. It's kick. different down south. You got houses in, 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 in the see south. The life and in the house is fighting for closets in New York. That's right. The, the, the problem is, you niggas are the white man. You have become the white man in your soul. Yes, yes. You wish to subconsciously dethrone him, but not to bestow your own throne. You want to sit in that nigga seat. Back. So when we talking about building a black nation, you know why niggas ain't building black nations? Cause you too busy trying to build the white man nation. So like he said, you in New York going crazy over an apartment. Why? Cause well, you want to be able to too. say you are living equivocally to that motherfucking cracker. Mm -hmm. When you could be easily buying a goddamn dollar house in Detroit, putting that same expensive ass Maybe New York money into cheaper. that house yep. and building a, a structure for your people. So we talk about black people. Crazy, see, though, black people we, I, I deal with right here. All my all my information I spit make you look in the mirror. Motherfucker, you want to look, you, we need to look in the mirror. Stop trying to be a cracker. Because mm. I say this all the time. If a goddamn bomb go off, Listen, I see the game they running. I see the game they running. Okay. Okay. Then when you see people that's just free flowing through the through the waves and they not getting no backlash, they just all in the media doing shows, doing events and not getting no pressure, but you speaking real liberation. And imagine to how many God, imagine how many this happened, brothers, this happened to that we don't even know about. Bro, it's easy. It's so easy for somebody in another rank to take down somebody like this for higher rank. Do you see what I'm trying to say? It's like the, the field versus the house. Like you got a W e. Du Bois type of that'll want to get on him. You know exactly what I'm trying to say if you know who that is. You got a Judas that'll get up on him for his higher rank at his police commission. Yo, this is just, it's too much, bro. And when y'all watch all these shows, right, and you see all these undercover agents and undercovers and they go in and infiltrate, what do they be trying to do, bro? What do they be trying to do on all these shows, bro? When you see these undercover, they be trying to solve the case or they be trying to stop what's going on. It don't matter what if it's about uh, drugs or whatever. When you watch most of these shows and it's an undercover agent, he come to take down the whole operation. But they definitely did something to this brother, bro, and Rashad, bro. And it's now that I'm seeing what's going on, with Rashad, they did. The, yeah, you can't tell me otherwise, bro. This is, it's fucked up, bro. What happened to Young Pharaoh, bro?